Hi there, I'm Christopher Dunnigan. This is Handmade in Vermont.com, and today we're talking about the Hubbardton Forge outdoor wall sconce called the Rook Medium. This is going to be the 30, 49, 33. There's a size uh, smaller than this, and there's a size larger. You should check them all out, as well as a post light. So check that out, too. This is coming in at 19.5 inches overall height, 4.8 inches wide, with a projection of 5. Point well, just five inches out. So it's also going to go midway up. So the mounting height is 9.8 inches from the bottom of the fixture to the middle of your electrical outlet box. And I want to show you a little more detail on that. If you're on our site, Handmade in Vermont, and you're on the page for this, look over on the right-hand side, midway down, you're going to see a link. It's going to say, click here for installations instructions PDF. So open that up for me if you can. You are going to see a lot of great info there. You are going to see a parts list. You're going to see how the glass goes on. The most important thing is you are going to see the back plate and how the back plate is made up of a front and then a wall around the whole thing. So when this is against your building, you'll notice that there's a box back there and there's enough wire to run all the way to the top of that. So it'll show you a lot of good info you guys want to know. Other little tidbit is when you have this installed and it's all on your house or your building, run a clear bead of silicone all the way around where the uh, sconce meets your building just a clear bead of it so you can't see it it'll seal that in, in so moisture and rain won't get in there and do anything bad in the future just a good thing so moving on why don't we talk about glass it's three inches in diameter 17 inches tall that's a nice big piece of glass Hubbardton says that this is a halogen fixture it's going to ship with a G9 halogen you're, you uh, have to stick with a 60 watt because of the heat generated by this if you want to do that. I recommend doing an LED, as I love LEDs, play around with them all the time. So this is a, a corn or a cob LED. You'll see all the little facets on there and some on the end. This is my favorite one because it's 75 watt equivalent. And there's, there are other ones too. If you don't need that, you can go down to like a 60 watt equivalent. And there's a, this is a phosphorus one. This is pretty cool too. Here's another phosphorus one. There's all kinds of these running around the internet. And it's, um, I got, probably got these on Amazon, I bet. Um, anyway, if you're in a big box store, do a couple things. Um, make sure you look at, or, or your local hardware store, which you should go to first. Look at the box if you guys are going to be buying these. Make sure they're the color temperature that you guys want. Same deal if you're online on Amazon or any other website. I like the glow of a warm bulb. That's going to be like an incandescent glow. That's 3000 Kelvin on the Kelvin scale, called a warm white. If you guys like the whiter daylight, go for the 4,000, 5,000 Kelvin on that, on that same scale, and you'll get that brighter, whiter light. Totally up to you. But anyway, you can also dim these too. If you have these like on a back porch or a deck and you want to be back there with your friends after dinner, having coffee after, after a big meal, you can put these on a dimmer. Just make sure you buy a dimmable bulb without a problem and you're good to go. So I want to touch on Hubberton Forge's glass for just a second. Hubberton Forge's opal glass is not just another piece of white glass. This is actually hand-blown glass. All of their glass is hand-blown. And to begin with, it's actually a clear piece of glass to start with. And then they come in, they blow a second layer on the inside of white glass. Then they come back and they do a third step where they sandblast the entire outside. So you'll notice when you get these in your hands, they actually have layers of glass on them on the end. You can see them on these two pieces. And it gives it this really soft, uh, semi-transparent, kind of milky quality. It's, it's a soft, soft glowing piece. Really, really pretty. You know, they're really obsessed about details at Hubberton Forge, and a lot of people don't, um, I don't think they appreciate it out in the world, but you appreciate it because that's why you guys are here watching this video. There you go. Let's talk about something else. Uh, same kind of idea. Um, they only use aircraft grade aluminum to make all of their outdoor lighting, and the reason they do that is because Aluminum holds up better than any other material in harsh, extreme weather. When you go out and you're out in the world, look up and you'll see those jet airlines flying up there way above your head. They're all made out of aluminum for a reason because it holds up beautifully, it welds beautifully, it doesn't rust, it's very light, and it's just the best material to use outside. So on top of that, they have developed these outdoor baked epoxy powder coats that can go over this and um, make them pretty much indestructible, and we're going to talk about that right now. So how they do this, you'll notice in the picture next to me, there's a picture of a woman and uh, she's actually shooting uh, powdered finish at the fixture. And they take the fixture, let's say this is the fixture to begin with, okay? They wire it up with a wire here, wire coming down. They run a small amount of electricity through it to make it positive. And what that does, it makes it attract everything around it. So when she's over there spraying little bits of powdered finish, what it's going to do, it's going to go over the entire fixture. It's going to get into every nook, every cranny, top, bottom, sides, the whole thing. They're going to take that fixture, they're going to put it into an oven. 
that's going to melt that down and turn and make it into a hard epoxy shell and it makes it you know incredibly strong <clears throat> because they do this and these things have been tested in these wind chambers where they have shot you know salty uh, seawater at them basically because that's what's going to happen on a beach right where a lot of these things are going to end up they had to really do that to make sure that they're going to hold up for you and because they do have done that they offer the best uh, warranty for the entire lighting industry and you can see that over on the, the left hand side of your screen limited lifetime warranty for residential use and check it out and it'll really make you feel better about their products cool. okay. moving on from there why don't we talk about our showroom in vermont we have over 350 hubberton forge fixtures spread across two floors we actually have a what's on display page on our website it's over on the red tabs over on the left hand side of your screen so you can open up that and check it out showroom has also a clearance center so clearance center stuff is 75 percent off msrp it's an amazing deal for you it's returns discontinued things and showroom samples if you guys are going to come visit us do me a favor bring a big suv <laughs> if you can if you have one only because the boxes are set up for shipping uh, measure everything you can think of so measure with a measuring tape measure your ceilings measure counters tables distances between junction boxes and things like ceilings because if you're looking you want to make sure when you're looking at these things that they're going to be able to be used by you for your needs okay um, and then um, also bring an ipad if you guys are doing a project and you have a tablet laying around at home take pictures with that take pictures and and you can bring that tablet in and we can go through all those pictures together and look and see what you guys are doing and i can help you out on that okay so when you buy your Hubberton Forge fixtures from HandmadeInVermont.com, shipping is free to every state except Alaska and Hawaii. No tax if we ship out of the state of Vermont. And we're the only dealer with 90-day returns and no restocking fees. No one else does that. Some larger items, generally big things on pallets and custom things are going to be non-returnable. We'll always tell you that on the page for it, so just keep your eyes peeled for that. And then on top of all that, we offer a rush program. So in order for you to get all of these different finishes, Hubberton Forge doesn't stock. It takes generally about three to four weeks to get product out. We can cut that time in half, and it is super, super inexpensive. A lot of people don't even know about it. If you want to know about it, the best thing to do is just drop me a quick email, sales at handmadeinvermont.com, and we spell out the word Vermont. You can also call 802-446-2400 during business hours. And so I'm here every day except Sunday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Time if you guys want to talk to me. And then you can email us, uh, you know, seven days a week at sales at handmadeinvermont.com and we spell out the word Vermont. So I think that kind of wraps things up on this. If you guys have any questions at all, let me know. Thank you for stopping in today. Take care. Bye-bye.